Hey, it's Mr. Peace. Just got done sharing my heart for a first time at St. Matthew Lutheran School in Wald Lake, Michigan, where I live too. So it's awesome to be able to share my heart in my own community, right? And we did it virtually. You'll see the laptop here and some of the other props that we had for the various talks. I spoke to grades pre-K through eighth, and we really wanted to focus on looking at the heart first, right? Even more than the word bullying, but really focus on kindness, choosing what we want. And as it relates to how God sees all of us for our heart first too, right? So we had a series of stories and examples, videos, music uh, that all tied into today's focus and really wanted to hammer home the concept of hurt people hurt people, which is a choice and a big reason why we sometimes don't show kindness because we are hurting, right? And the easy thing to do is to go hurt someone else and hurt their feelings too. The hard thing to do is to forgive, but our father teaches us to forgive, right? And to allow his love to fully enter our heart. And if we can do that, we turn that hurt people who hurt people into healed people who healed people. A big part of what we talked about is letting Christ fully enter our heart, right? To be able to purify it, to cleanse it, and to bring that healing that we many times need throughout our lives. And thinking about Isaiah 53, by his wounds we are healed, right? By his ultimate sacrifice, him dying on the cross, you know, paying that ultimate price for us, we become these healed people. Now we have to go out into the world and help heal other people and be able to see them again for their heart before anything else. First Samuel says that man, woman, many times we look at the outward appearance, the outside of somebody, but God always looks at the heart and our heart being as big as our fist. If we do let God love, compassion, peace fully enter into here, we can turn this into this, the peace sign, one finger being ourself, the other for someone we're trying to lift up higher than ourselves by how we choose to treat them, right? Hopefully with a lot of acts of kindness and a lot of love, but it's also it's also two because in just two seconds, one two, one breath, one heartbeat, what we say or do can stay in someone's heart in a positive or a negative way for the rest of their life, right? We have that choice to be able to see someone for that first, to be the healed people who healed people, but also to see people for this too. We talked about that all of us have the letter M etched on all of our palms with the lines of our hand. And in Isaiah 49, it says, I have engraved on the palm of my hands. And, th and this is the proof, right? To know that Psalm 139, we are all fearfully and wonderfully made. We have to remember that, right? We have to know our worth, our value, and continue to do God's work here on earth. And like the shirt says, miracle, it's not just enough for us to believe that we are. We have to go out into this world and help others who may not see that be the light to their heart. Help them see that they are true miracles as well. And then we're doing our job, right? As Christians, as as, as believers that we are starting to not only talk the talk, but also walk the walk. And moreover, this means that we know that like this pledge here, this gift that I received from some students years ago, like it reads, one kind word can change someone's entire day. To know that one kind word can truly change someone's entire life. So we need to be all in for this planet. We need to be all in this for, for this earth and be able to keep seeing people for their heart first and keep doing God's will here on earth to keep advancing his kingdom. As always, thanks so much for touching my heart. Make sure to hit the subscribe button that you'll see pop up on the screen here and the notification bell if you want to receive future updates on videos just like this. You can also look at this other incredible playlist with some inspirational clips. And don't forget to check out my website as you can track my journey and follow me as I continue to spread God's love, share his message, and heal America's hearts one school at a time. Peace.